Hello! Welcome to Red Sith here! Where did she get that? I would like this, please. What? She just has a steel sword laying around and I can't use it? I want it. I want that sword. Alright. Anyways. Yes! Excellent. Thank you so much! Yay! I sold a steel sword! Excellent. Let us do that just one more time. <sighs> to be sure. Hello! Welcome to Reset Dear. I would like this, please. Hello! Welcome to Reset Dear. I would like this, please. I'm sure you would. Yes, an excellent price. Thank you so much. Yay, I sold a steel sword. Expertly done. If you ever wish to practice again, simply ask me. I could do this all day. Anytime we are in the shop. I'll be sure to keep that in mind. Anytime now. Yeah. And that is essentially how it goes. You are quite good for someone who has never done this before. <laughs> <laughs> really? We still have a little bit of time left today, so let us go ahead and open the store proper. We could just about have a uh, have an incomplete sentence counter. We should. If anyone comes in, simply handle them in the same way that we just practiced. Oh, I will handle them expertly. Whoa, you sure it'll be okay? Do not worry. As the saying goes, salesmanship is more of an art than it is a science. You learn as you go. Now then, I will open us up. Go on and sit at the counter. Ooh. Okay, day. What? what kind of word is that? I don't know. Welcome! Ooh, this is nice. This was good shopping. Thank you so much. Glee! I sold walnut bread. Glee? I thought glee was an emotion, not a word that you say out loud. I thought glee was a club where you sang. I'm not fond of them. Glee club. Congratulations! You did well! I sold stuff. I, me, Rossetti, I sold stuff, like, to people! And not mannequins! Hey, Tear, I. I'm so happy! I, I did it! Tear, I did it! Papa, I did it! And that's how we started running an item shop. Oh, you're wondering why we started an item shop at all? Well, for that, we would have to start at the beginning. Oh, well, to explain that, you will need to understand how we first met. We could have started at the beginning in the first place, but... Yeah. Easy Game Station presents A Tale of a Fairy A Girl Ellipse And Ellipse and how they how to run an item shop Reset here
Let's see. Yep. Calendar says it's been three months since Papa left. I don't get why he suddenly said, I'm gonna be a hero! And then took off without saying when he'd be back. Oh well. I'm sure nothing bad will happen to him to advance the plot or anything. I really hope he's okay. I'm getting lonely. Well, I shouldn't worry too much about him. The best thing about him is how tough he is. He'll be okay. Nothing can possibly kill him. What? Papa wouldn't knock. Who is that? Hi. Yes, who is it? Huh, nobody here. Wait, what? At my feet? Good evening. Why is she question marked? We know her name! You've already shown us the name! Um... You are Mademoiselle Reset Lemongrass? Um... Miss Fairy? Pardon me, but I am the one asking questions. Again, you are Reset Lemongrass! Uh, um... Yes, I I'm Reset. My name is Tyr. I am an agent of the Terramy Finance Company. I'm assuming the E is silent. Make up your mind. Yes, ma'am. Finance Company? I am here to collect payment on a loan paid out to your father. Here is the contract. And my identification. Uh, loan repayment. Uh, I uh. In planner terms, I am here to get our money back. If you are incapable of facilitating repayment, this house will be seized as collateral in order to repay the loan. Facilitating. Collateral... Seize? What? But, uh, I, I, Pop, Papa is in... He is not here. Yes, I see that now. Monsieur Lemongrass has appeared following a freak at uh, top the local volcano, so we assumed he might have returned here. Yes, because the obvious answer to someone fighting a giant monster on top of a volcano is that they went home. Of course. Or else would they, I mean, I'm sure he didn't fall inside the volcano and crash and burn. Oh, obviously not. Even if he has not, however, the contract covers these, this eventuality. It covers this? Quite. As the sole remaining member of this household, we shall require that you pay his debts in his stead. Oh, what? But, but how am I supposed to? I, I, I barely have enough money to live by, by myself. Naturally. We are not demanding it all be repaid at once. There is still a small amount of time before any payment is due. Therefore... Am I gonna get sold off in parts to distant foreign lands to repay Papa's debts? I wonder if I can, I can survive with only two internal organs. Maybe if I eat a lot of spinach, I can replace my blood. And, but I don't want to be a sailor! What am I going to do? Ahem! Please listen to me for a moment. I have no clue where are you getting these ludicrous ideas from. But I would never do such a thing. Quite the opposite, in fact. I was sent here to ensure that you wouldn't have to resort to such... Well... Absurd methods to pay us back. 